right, XDA and YouTube. I have a Y Hey a Sendmate 2 right here. I just got it yesterday. I set it up just for the fun because I was waiting for my unlock code from mobile at hawaii.com. And they finally got it right here. And this is thank you for supporting Oahe devices. Your unlock code is blah blah blah. Please keep your unlock code properly. Thank you. And all I said was, hello, I purchased an Oahe Sendmate 2 and I would like my bootloader unlock code. Here's my serial number and here's my IMEI number. Thank you. Uh, everybody on XDA says it takes 5 to 10 minutes. It didn't do that for me. It took all day. I think I got it around 2.30 in the morning. I guess it's depending on where they're coming from. I guess it sounds like mine came from China. So, I don't really have any experience unlocking any bootloaders. All I've ever done was just hook up my, uh, my phones. I mean, here's my last phone, the LG Optimus G Pro. And, uh, I hooked it up to the computer and just click unroot. I've also done it to my tabs and my HTC ones and, but this is the first one I'm gonna have to physically unlock the bootloader first so I'm gonna create a video because there's not too many out there so anyways your phone has to be on debug and uh, USB debugging and once that's on you hook up your phone install the drivers and you need to have 15 second ADB installer Installed and I have a link to that on uh, ADB stands for Android Debug Bridge and basically it's just a gateway between your computer and your phone to communicate. So once that's up and installed you're going to want to go to your command prompt. Now that's up. Now we're going to type in <coughs> excuse me CD C colon backslash ADB. Now you're in your ADB directory right here. Okay. From there, we're going to type in ADB devices. And it's going to look for it. And you remember, my phone's hooked up to my computer right here, to my little USB. And he's debugging his on. There it is right there. Okay. So next, we're going to type in fast boot. OEM unlock and your 15 digit code. And click enter. It says waiting for device. As you guys can see, my phone's right here, it's not doing anything. And notice how it doesn't do anything. So we're going to want to unplug it. We're going to power it off. We're going to hold the volume up, rock down, the volume down rocker, and the power button. And then let go of the volume up button. Now we're in bootloader. See how it says status locked at the top? Okay, once that's in, we're going to want to plug it back in. Okay, it reset the phone right away. It says finish total time right here. Okay, bootloader unlocking. And voila, it should be unlocked. Notice how it's opening my ADB drivers for my phone. We're going to click out of this. This is all finished now. We're going to close this because it says finished total time, point tenths of a second. Now I believe this should have factory reset my phone because it's what everybody's saying. So we're going to find out right now.
there you go factory reset okay